What have you got all these people here for today? Well, we want to prepare the uh, outside of the Abbey site for visitors coming and it's soon... make it really tidy because there's been lots of litter over the winter. That's without trying. Now, how long have you been collecting just to get that? Five minutes. It's appalling, isn't it? We were just saying that we've missed some flipping good parties up here because it's it's exciting to come and be somewhere, but take your rubbish home. How much? £120 on the spot. You think so? Get them done. Would it work? Probably not. <laughs> Do you reckon it's groups of old age pensioners coming up here doing raves? <laughs> that Lee is that that we'll, I'm looking at on the floor. It's an aerosol can. In that walk over there, that's... Have you got it? I've got it, yeah. <laughs> Here we've got alcohol and deodorant. So if the drink makes you sweat, you can freshen up. <laughs> Doesn't matter where you go, people drop it. They do. You should pick it up. They should. It's not difficult. And don't blame the council, that's the other thing. People blame the council. They can only do so much, can't they? Well, people didn't drop it in the first place. The council, you know, why did the council get the blame for it? She beat me. Second time. Just tell me that again. What's the favourite drink up at the quarry? Strongbow. Fruit, fruit flavoured Strongbow, yeah. There, in the pee bag right there. It's that cement. Um, sand and cement that's gone hard in a bag and it's too heavy to clear the litter so and there's a couple of them. Somebody's dumped their building rubbish here. Yeah. Oh, there's another one. You're right, it's a concrete bag and mix and... Yeah. Well that saved them going to the tip, didn't it? Is there a poo bag even in the grounds of the Abbey? Some of this stuff must have been here years. We do do it, but you sometimes miss, and it comes to the surface again. Yeah, it's a bit like archaeology, isn't it? Yeah, very much so. But not as not as, not as it fulfilling. This is fast food in the grounds of Furnace Abbey. Yeah. I mean, why throw it in there? How did you get through there? A little bit like. She what? sneaked in the what? Abbey without yeah. paying. She wrap it up, this, isn't it? <laughs> It's Look much e it. it's much Look easier it. just to chuck your litter over the fence, you know, than come in and drop it. Can and a bottle there. Right. Watch that. This is one side of the original gatehouse to Furnace Abbey, so we must be talking 13, 1400 built. And here is a 21st century can of, it looks a little like that sweet cider again. That seems to be the most popular drink. Fru fruit ciders. It's got to be sweet, hasn't it? It has. Off you go. Here again in the medieval gatehouse, what do we find? Well, let's zoom in and you can tell us. Oh, it's beginning to make sense. What are they? Poo bags. Have I got to say that? Goodness, all right, this'll be funny. Could it be medieval poo? <laughs> <laughs> I doubt it. Mm. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. That is, isn't it? And there's more than just one there, isn't there? Yeah. You're inside the grounds of the Abbey. I know. <laughs> and there's, is there rather a lot inside the Abbey well, grounds? Well, people tend to throw things over. As they walk in past. And although English Heritage do oh, litter pick every single day and clear it all, it's back again the next day. So just giving them a quick hand. So what's the solution? Don't throw it. Yeah. Don't throw it and reduce packaging. Can we count them? You can count them if you like. We could have a competition, guessing how many there might be. I'm going for 15. 11, 12, 13, 24. 24. She's on to 25. Place your bets, are we going to reach 30? How many poo bags do you get? Does that mean 29 people came over with their dogs, they did a poo and they left the bag? Or could it perhaps mean they chucked it over as they were walking past? Chucked it over as they were walking past. That is very, very lazy. So this is where the dog 
will have walked and this is where the poo bag will have been chucked. So they are lots of dog poo bags in one big bag and dumped. So this is the dog poo dump of this area. Smashing. In a heritage setting. Yeah. I mean, I, this is a medieval gatehouse, huge building, to a medieval church over there, and it's now the poo repository. So we found the, the cement that was in the edge before one of our kind volunteers has brought it out. Right. And the van will be coming to pick it up soon. Right, I'm going to do litter pick every single day and clear it all. It's back again the next day, so just giving them a quick hand. So, what's the solution? Don't throw it. Don't throw it and reduce packaging.